Come on, guys. Let's talk about it. So you see Master P and you see Mystical. They right here. They on the screen right beside me. What's going on? Mystical is in trouble again for, for rape. Right now, it's allegations. But Master P, his brother, is coming out in the defense of his brother saying, hey, we need to get this dude out and stuff like that. First, guys, I want I just want to say this. Mind your freaking business, please. Mind your business. If this wasn't Master P, if this wasn't Mystical, we wouldn't even be privy to this information. That's one thing. Two, we don't know the facts. We are regular people. We just know what we hear. And we already making assumptions based off this guy past. And we already making assumptions based on headlines of what media has said. When we look at Master P as Mr. Ice Cream Man, as No Limit, as Perry Miller. But Master P is fighting for his brother. That is a family issue, a family matter. And I ain't talking about Urkel or nothing like that. I'm just talking about family matter. You know what I'm talking about. But I'm saying he's fighting for that. And, 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 and it's so publicized, we're not able to give this dude space and grace to handle it the way that he see fit. So this is what we have to do, guys. And, 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 and I want to teach you. I want to learn you. I, I, I want to learn you right now. Let's wait until information come out before we start cashing dispersions on people. Let's wait for that. Two, let's be able to separate two things. Let's be able to separate uh, a conviction, uh, a problem somebody did in their past with support for that person. Because let me, let, me, let me break it down in layman term. My son, if my son go out here, and I'm going to be honest and real, if my son go out here and murder somebody, on one hand, justice will be served. I'm corroborating with my son. I'm, 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 I'm sorry, I'm, co I'm corroborating with the police because my son shouldn't took somebody's life. But as a father, I will go visit my son in prison. As a father, I will be there to support him. I don't care what you say. This is my son. This is my blood. He need to own up to his stuff and he's in the system that's giving him his just due. And what I'm not gonna do as a father is turn my back on my son just because the world, you people, deem him as a monster. You looking at him as a monster, you don't know him. You didn't wipe his nose. You didn't wipe his butt. You didn't tuck him in the bed. You didn't get up every morning and take him to school. You didn't hold him when he was sick. You didn't do none of that. This is my son. You just look at this person in the, as a story and a headline. But this is my son. And as a man, what I'm going to do is say, son, you, 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 got, you got to deal with the consequences. But as a father, I have the right to still be in my son's life. You see what I'm talking about? See, what that happened is, man, we live inside a world that yells about second chances, but we live in a country that nobody gives out second chances. But we live in this world of second words and third words that tear people down, that degrade them just because they did something years ago and because allegations has arose. Guys, we got to stop. We cannot be mad at Master P for trying to be there for his brother in his time of need. Is that what we're doing? Is that what we're promoting? We're just throwing people by the wayside, but we're able to sit in our comfortable house, in our comfortable chairs. We're able to sit there and drink our coffee in the morning, drink our Starbucks, and go on with our life. And now we feel all high and mighty because the consensus of the world, or I ain't even gonna say world, the consensus of the US of media has said that we have to deem this person a monster. I'm gonna leave it with this. I'm really gonna leave it with this. What would you want if you was in this situation? And don't be like, I wouldn't even be in this situation in the first part. Shut up. Everybody them did something in their life that they needed some grace and they needed some space. And they wish that they had somebody there for support. So my question to you, if you found yourself in a situation, the only thing that could help was support of people. What would you want? Guys, I want you to go down in the comments and let me know what would you want? What would you do? And you let them know Mr. Noah all said it.